Energy is a booming industry in the Lone Star State, and the East Texas Oil Museum is offering an inside look at the business. They're holding an event today where you can learn directly from professionals in the field. KTK's Olivia Sandusky joins us live now. Olivia, good morning. What does the day look like? Well, good morning, Cynthia. At 9 a.m., it's all going to start right here at the East Texas Oil Museum out in Kilgore. Of course, if you are part of this day, you can take a free tour of the museum, and I really recommend that because some of the new features they have in there are pretty exciting. Then after that, they're going to head over to the college at 10 a.m. That's where the speakers will get going, and the whole event really begins. Now, the speakers that will be present are all from a few of the major e energy industries. They'll talk about some different market strategies, and everyone interested in attending is welcome. Everybody from students to professionals will be there. And after the speakers finish, a lunch will be served. That's where the attendees get to network and interact. Here's why the museum director says this industry is so important to East Texans. The oil um, is a lot of the reason that we grew, and with that um, came a whole influx of individuals into East Texas. The field's 45 miles north to south. That affects a lot of communities here in, in northeast Texas. Um, and without the oil industry, a lot, of, a lot of folks would not be here, and a lot of jobs would not be here. Now, this is the 10th annual energy symposium being held here in Kilgore. They asked people to register beforehand, but they said, of course, they won't turn anyone away at the door. And tickets for this are $50. Now, that money will be donated back to the East Texas Oil Museum to help it keep functioning. And the director told me if you miss that tour beforehand after the event's all over, you're welcome to come back. She'll help you see the rest of the museum after the day is done. Reporting live in Kilgore, Olivia Sandusky, KETK News.